Hi everyone, welcome back to All Things Kawaii. Um, in this video, I wanted to share with you guys my planners and my journals and all that fun stuff. I'm super, super obsessed with journaling and planning, even though I have nothing to plan for. <laughs> um, but it's just fun. Um, so if you would like to see all my journals and planner planners, um, keep on watching. And just letting you know really quickly, I do have a lot of planners because several of them were gifts and I didn't want them to just sit there looking pretty. I wanted to actually use them. So even though I write pretty much the same exact thing in all of them, that's why I have so many of them. Um, so let's just jump right into it. So the first one I have here is this one, which is my newest journal. And I just started bullet journaling. This is a super cute gold metallic, it's kind of like a leather material. And it says my thoughts, the arrow underneath. Um, this is by the brand Studio O. It says it was $14.99, but I bought this from the Go Calendar store and it was on sale for a dollar. They had a lot of stationery and things like that on sale for a dollar. I went a bit crazy, but I did purchase um, another one of these. And then on here, I just have a little coral clip with little polka dots that I got from Hobby Lobby, I think. Um, no Michaels. It came in a little like pack with like sticky notes and stuff. But I always use that. Well, I use it because it helps keep the pages together. Um, I started this. It says collect moments not things I mean well <laughs> I collect things but this is my first spread for me um, it's not that great but you know we all got to start somewhere um, I do want to do some videos on bullet journaling once I get more um, into it and get more spreads going on but this is how it basically looks um, so this is what this journal is going to be for I did want to use a journal that had no lines but I didn't have any of them they all had lines so it's fine this is going to be my bullet journal whatever just whenever I'm done with this one I'll definitely get one that doesn't have lines okay so the next journal I have I don't know why I'm out of breath why am I out of breath <laughs> um this one is super cute too it says fun vibes only and it's like in a gold metallic and it has like hot pink like scattered polka dots this one I also got from the go calendar store um, for a dollar. It's by the brand Grafique and this is was $10.99 and I got a cute little bunny donut sticker there. This is my, I don't use this one all the time, but this is for all my washi tape and stickers. It's my um, swatching journal. I like to swatch just because um, whenever I do use up all the stickers or journal um, or sticky notes, um, I'll always remember which ones I've had. I know it's crazy, um, but I do it. And so yeah, that's what this journal is for. Only for that. Whenever I do get new ones, I try to put as many of the swatches as I can in there. Okay, so for my first planner I have, this one was actually a gift from my mom and it's super cute. Um, it is like this lavender color with all these adorable little llamas. And FYI, excuse my nails. They're really ratchet right now. They're gross. Um, just because... Um, I need to paint my nails. <laughs> um, anyway, this is from the Dollar General. So it was only a dollar. And she bought this for me. And it's just like the most basic kind of... Oh, no. There goes my camera. Great. <laughs> Let's keep that in there. <laughs> um, uh, it's a really basic planner. So this is how it looks. And it has just like overview of each month per month nothing much to it I just pretty much write what I basically the most important thing I did throughout the day sleep <laughs> um, basically throughout this quarantine uh, but yeah that's what I have for this planner um, and the next one I have is actually like a little like notepad desk thing that you leave per week and it says my week no problema this is from Walmart and I believe this was like three dollars it was really cheap whenever the school supply stuff came out but we've got purple and hot pink and lime llamas and cactuses on the top and it's like a grid and I just kind of like separate them per day and I kind of write what the main points that I did throughout the day I always try to do something productive um whether it's clean something really good um I just don't want to waste my time but sometimes I can be really lazy <laughs> it's it's hard but yeah so I have that and I leave that obviously on my desk and this one I leave on my desk as well. Um, 
So this one, my boyfriend actually purchased for me from, I believe, Marshalls. Yeah, it was $7.99. It's by Orange Circle Studio. And this is like a really nice made <laughs> planner. It's like a coral with white llamas and cactuses. And it's got like gold foiling. It's super pretty. Very well made calendar. This is Desert Llamas. Um, I'm not going to go through like each and every single thing, but this is how it looks. This is the overview. And then per each day, it has a little area here that you can kind of like write in what happened during that day um, or whatever. Um, so that's what I have. And then this one actually came with stickers and you have like a little notes section in the back. So yeah, I use a little bookmark to um keep my place for the day so that's that planner i really like it it's super pretty so that one this weekly spread one this one and both of these live on my desk okay my little hamster fell okay <laughs> the next journals i have i keep in a journal bag this is the journal bag i'm using right now it's just kind of like maroon corduroy tote bag I switch them out and then I have this is from forever 21 it's got a really big pocket and then I have this like burnished gold little llama so you can tell I love llamas he's got little tassels and he looks very vintagey and that was actually a gift um I think it was like a Christmas gift but in this journal in my journal bag I always carry um a pencil pouch or a pen pouch. I switched these out as well. I'm crazy. I know. This one is from Wish, I believe, but it's got little white llamas and it says no problem or no drama llama with hearts. And usually in these, I just carry basic like pens. I have like colored pens from like the Dollar Tree and like nothing super cute because you're not going to see it. So I always carry that and I use a different pen each day. I know. I'm crazy. Um, and then I have this clear pouch that actually came from my planner last year that I actually cut out and I just decorated it in like random stickers. Um, and this has planner stickers in here that I use on my planner, just random stickers I just decorate with. I'm not gonna go through these. Um, this will be like in another video. Um, so that's just what I carry. Um, the next thing I have, and I write in these every single day. Like nine times out of 10, I write in them every day. Um, so I always have a little small planner. Usually this one I will keep in like my purse if it fits. Um, it's just very small. Um, this one is from the Dollar Tree. It's super cute. It's got dragon fruit and limes and lemons. It's got a little lemon in the back. And this one is just, again, a very simple one. It has it per day. It doesn't have like an overview of the month. It just has like a little area for you to write what happened during the day. A little paragraph so that's from the Dollar Tree obviously a dollar and then I always have my actual journal that I write in every single day so this is like a journaling journal journal <laughs> does that make any sense I probably don't even make any sense but um, I write in it every day just pretty much like my thoughts what happened throughout the day um, anything interesting um, sometimes I write poetry I, I like to write poetry but I don't write it as often as I'd like but I just as soon as I doodle in it it's just kind of a journal that I like writing pen and paper it's just so calming and relaxing to me to do at the end of every day or sometimes several times throughout the day if I have the chance to do um, but this one I believe is from an Easter basket from I think last year if I'm correct but it's got the little white prancing llamas with the purple background and then it's got like a little tribal print area there it doesn't have Dolgan Corp I don't know um, and then it opens up like this. So yeah, I just write in it every single day and I decorate it with stickers and I always have like a little bookmark so I know where I left off. So that's my actual journal and I use a new one like every month and a half to two months. Um, so yeah, that's what I have there. My next journal well, this is my actual real planner. So this is the planner I bought or intended to have one planner. This was the planner. I got it at Ross. Um, it was only 
and it says it's by tri coastal design but it's really pretty it says 2020 and it's rainbow with like a holographic kind of foiling thing going on and i just have a llama sticker and um it holds everything in by like a little band and this i always carry sticky notes and like stickers and it just looks like that of course it's like a basic i'll probably do like an actual flip through in another video this video is already too long but yeah this is my actual planner and then i started getting more <laughs> but i love it though and it gets the job done and then some and then the last planner <laughs> oh my god this is ridiculous this one i got for christmas um <laughs> i couldn't say no to it. i mean it has llamas on it it's mints with llamas and cactuses, and it kind of has like coral peach colors in there. Um, and this one's kind of like a plastic material, but it's like thick. And this is by Clementine Paper Incorporation. Um, this one, again, it's kind of like color coded. You have like a full like spread, and then like per each day, you can kind of like write in it. Um, so yeah, this one is super cute. Originally, I wanted to find a planner. I had a planner last year from Michael's and it was like $30, but it was really well made and the spreads on it were great. Um, and I was really trying to find another llama one and I couldn't find one anywhere, even online. So that's why I got the rainbow one, but I still love it no matter what. Okay. The last journal, this is my food journal. <laughs> even though I don't eat healthy at all. Like I literally drink big red like water, um, but I kind of gives, gives me like an overview of what I eat roughly per day and semi like count my calories, even though it's not pretty accurate, but um, I just keep up with it. And it's, it's just nice to see. Anyway, this one is from the Dollar Tree and it's a composition book. It's got boba, it's got donuts, it's got coffee cups and tarts. It's super cute, and I put hashtag kawaii on there. <laughs> yeah, and uh, it was just from the Dollar Tree. So yeah, I just write pretty much what I eat every day and how much, like, the calories and the, at the end of the day and, like, a little notes section. Um, but I usually use a composition book or an actual, like, journal, like a notebook journal. Does that make sense? Um, for my food journal. And I only used one last year, so this one will probably last me, like, probably throughout the year almost but yeah so that is all the journals that I have um all my planners everything um it's a, it's very excessive I know but I love them all and they all serve their purpose and they make me really excited and I love decorating them and writing in them journaling just makes me really happy so yeah I hope you like this video um and if you did, please give it a thumbs up. Let me know in the comments what did you think of this video. Um, and if you like journaling, if you like planners, <laughs> let me know down below too. Um, I will be making a bullet journal video or kind of like a plan with me video um, probably in the next month. And I also have a lot of, um, I don't know why I did that. Why did I do that? I have a lot of stickers coming in from AliExpress and stationery coming in from Romway. And so stay tuned for hauls and stay tuned for um, unboxings. So I'm really excited. Anyway, thank you so much for tuning in. Um, don't forget to subscribe for all things kawaii, journaling, DIY, stationery, all those things. Um, and uh, have a great day, night, whenever you're watching this, and I will see you in the next video. Okay, bye. Oh, and don't forget, if any of you guys know any other YouTubers out there that specify in bullet journaling, can you please leave links or leave their names down below in the comments? I would love to know. I'm always looking for more YouTubers out there that specifically do videos on those. Um, but yeah, that's it. Um, as always, stay kawaii, my friends, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.